Hello everyone, this is me, Sabia here, and I'm back with the monthly read for the month of April 2024. This reading is going to be for the sign of Scorpio. Look at that one. Scorpio, let's see what's coming in for you in the month of April 2024. I will be adding a lot many cards here in this reading, so stay tuned. And we will also be tapping into your relationship dynamics as well in this reading. So yeah, just be mindful. It's a journal reading. It may and it may not resonate with everyone out there. Pick whatever resonates and leave the rest for personal reads. You can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can also check out other services that I offer as well in the description box. So let's see. What is coming up for Scorpio in the month of April? What is coming in? What's going to be happening for you? What can you expect? Wow. So we have... Okay. Um, wedding rings are uh, union, marriage, soul connection, everlasting love, devotion. Not enough. Look at, lacking confidence, self-sabotage, ego and fear, frustrations. Hammer, sabotage, rebuild, persistent, working on it, repairing. Clock, needing time, cycles, takes time. Time to heal, progressing. Wow, look at that. Hmm, give me a moment to look deeper into it. What's coming in for Scorpio? Make sure that, you know, you're not overeating or overindulging into anything right now. Um, especially feeling not getting what you want or feeling blocked in any possible way. Because I really see that uh, there is a chance that, you know, whatever you desire, whatever you want, uh, it might be taking long to happen. It might be taking long to come through. Um, the clock might be ticking for you and you are kind of like, you know, feeling, uh, you know, um, blocked in, in, in a way where you feel that probably, you know, it's um, nothing is going to happen. You know, you're just being frustrated about something. Be that in love, work or home life. There is something that you have... Uh, waited to happen and i feel like maybe you you gave your time uh yourself some time that okay fine i'm gonna do it or have it in the month of april and if, if it's not happening it's just gonna mess your head up and i really feel like you know this is something that you can avoid by first of all especially uh, for those of you who are manifesting uh, or trying to use tools and techniques to make it happen don't give yourself some time frames around it because the more you're gonna stress yourself out with the time frames the more are the chances you're not going to get it because you will feel lack of it in your life more than anything else. So even if you are trying to manifest something or even if you are not trying to manifest something, it's just that you are giving yourself some goals to achieve. Keep those, um, you know, the time frames open. You know, don't don't restrict yourself in, in, in time frames because I really see you will uh, feel blocked because you would not be able to achieve what you want to achieve within a certain time uh, period. Um, the more you are relaxed, the more other chances you're going to get there quicker. So make sure that you don't sabotage your progress by thinking, oh my God, it's not happening. You are definitely progressing towards something that you want to happen. Uh, so take let it take time. Let it happen on divine timing. Whatever it is, I really see you um, building blockages by getting so obsessed with it. When, 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 when. So you've got to stop that i really feel like you know, your your mind is continuously telling you when is it going to happen when is it going to happen your fears are continuously asking you that you have to stop it and allow whatever it is that you desire to come through i really feel like you know for a majority of you um you need time to relax um uh try to get rid of the frustration try to get rid of the obsession try to get rid of the negativity and just be persistent and good in doing what what you want to manifest take baby steps towards it and you will achieve it um try to take time to heal relax breathe uh because you are maybe obsessing over too much uh, in, uh on the situation um i really feel like in you know, a majority of you you're wanting union marriage connection with a specific someone you really want someone who lasts forever in your life uh, maybe that's not happening maybe you have a specific someone that you want to have that with but you don't see it coming through but all you have to do is wait relax calm down and you will see it coming i feel like you know things are progressing in the right direction just that you are being fearful just that you are feeling lack of confidence try to relax yourself off because i really feel like you know there, there is not much to worry about but you are obsessing over it and that's why your worries are getting stronger and 
you know heavier on you let's see what else is coming in for you in the month of uh, april scorpio i'm not going to talk about this much because all the three cards are not so positive there are some blockages that you're creating uh, by not having the confidence in yourself and which is the reason why things are being delayed so if you are planning i really see that you will have delays in your plans delays in your your desire and it's all because you're kind of considering like you know it has to happen in a certain time frame let it happen just just relax it will happen for majority of you i really feel like yes it is going to happen you will have that union with someone specific but uh you know whether you know that specific someone or not but there is that marriage coming in there is that commitment that you desire coming in but you have to let it come through don't stress yourself around the time frame situation let's see what else is coming in for you i'm not going to take all these cards there are so many let's see what else is coming in for you in the month of april okay we do have the emperor Okay. what is coming in for you for those of you who are waiting for a specific someone like your prince or your princess that person is definitely going to show up again you don't have to worry about something i really feel like you know there are delays but the delays are going to get over uh, hopefully in the month of april itself so don't stress yourself out uh you know i feel like you know for some of you um, you might see a positive change or shift in the very beginning of the month, uh, but then the rest of the month is going to be very slowed down again. So that might start stressing you. But I feel like you know, for those of you who are going to be keeping yourself, uh, um, you know, positive and, you know, confident, they are going to experience the shift coming quicker than anybody else. I feel like, you know, for a majority of you, you have to know one thing that, um, you know, this, this uh, situation that you have on your mind right now, um, that you're kind of unable to kind of get off your head. Um, you have to relax about it. I feel like, you know, the sooner you get relaxed around it, you surrender, you let go, the sooner your wish is going to come to fruition. For some of you, I really see the good news that you're waiting. Uh, that would come through. Let me take one card for this uh, two king of wands here. Let me take one card from the middle of the deck. Stress, okay. Are there two people involved here or one? Okay. I really see for some of you uh, two people two opportunities coming in your love um, one is um, and I really feel like you know for majority of you both these people have the same energy you know you would get confused like you know is he or she the one or there is somebody else uh, who's coming towards me in love especially for those of you who are stuck in a relationship for quite some time you don't know if, if uh, he or she is the one uh, because you're open to have you know the wedding coming in you don't see anything moving in your love life and if that's the case i really feel like you know you need to know one thing you know whether it's uh, somebody from the past returning or whether it's somebody new coming there is someone coming who's going to own um you know their their feelings their emotions towards you and they're going to propose you so you know you need to know one thing you are going to get proposed in the month of april you are going to get that you know um, marriage um, situation developing for you uh, an everlasting connection is going to come through for you in the month of uh, April that's for sure but now for some of you you might be blocking this energy to enter in your life by thinking like you know who is he or she going to be like is it going to be somebody that uh, you know for some of you could be dealing with the same sex situation as well but you are confusing yourself with the thought that is he or going to or is she going to be the one or is it going to be somebody else? Don't think too much about who that person is going to be. Just know that you are going to be getting exchanging married uh, wedding rings with someone for sure in the month of uh, April. I really see commitment coming in. I really see something solid happening here in the month of uh, uh, April for you. Don't obsess about the, you know, the, the details that you want to know right now. Just allow the divine to make things happen uh for you so i really see everything else is going to be panning out for you uh naturally so you don't have to stress about that um let's see um what else is coming in for you what else is coming in for you let's see uh your mantra for the month of april your mantra for the month of april Your mantra for the month of April. And then we're going to tap into the relationship dynamics as well. Let's see your mantra for the month of April. 
what shall be your mantra okay speeding in oh, sorry stepping into stillness my power is born in the majesty of silence again try to silent your mind up right now um your power your strength to manifest all and everything to have all the knowledge information that you need right now is in your silence when you are silence when you are uh, in your silence you calm your mind you step into your stillness god will start guiding you telling you whatever it is that you need to do so make sure that you're using uh, meditations during this month because it is going to bring forth whatever information that you need around your situation i really see for majority of you you are torn between two things two people two situation step into stillness and you will find what is the right thing for you to do um your power is going to be like in that so yeah, let's see um what is going to be your relationship dynamics okay your relationship dynamics your relationship dynamics in the month of April what is it gonna be like your relationship dynamics in the month of April fearless love a courageous leap into the unknown again you don't have to know certain things right now the divine is going to think uh, unfold things for you in in the in your love life right now and i really feel like you, know, you just have to prepare yourself up for something big to happen um i really see somebody coming in your life who's fearless somebody who's uh, going to be expressive who's going to be um very much into you that they don't need to hold themselves back this person is going to be somebody mature than you and i really feel like you know this person is uh, the divine really wants you to know one thing with this person you would not have to hold yourself back for sure so this person and you are definitely going to have a good chemistry but uh not just that i really feel like you know your connection with this person is going to be fearless magical you would not have to hold yourself back in any possible way from this person in any possible way you would be able to have that connection with this person which is going to be like uh, um they're going to love you for all your flaws for all the goodness that you have to offer this is how they are going to be so i really see that it is going to be full of love compassion and you would not have to hold yourself back or you don't have to stop acting a certain way to to attract this person in your life they are going to love you for who you are so just be your authentic self and that's what is going to be attracted them to you so yeah that's uh, pretty much it coming up for you for the month of april if it was of help to like share and subscribe till later the next week take care bye